Welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing? I hope everyone is doing well. So, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a special from War Thunder today. I'm late to all my videos today, but I will catch up two videos for the day with this one and another video. And please, ladies and gentlemen, please don't forget to hit that like, comment, share, and subscribe. It will be really appreciated. So, what are we looking at? What is Israel? Uh, what is I just tell you that today. The Israeli A4E is back for an anniversary of of its maiden flight. Uh, uh, this is I don't like covering all of these things because some of the stuff is just all dust. But anyway, on on July twelfth, nineteen sixty one, A4E, a highly mod modernized version of the Douglas A4 Skyhawk, carry carrier capable light attack aircraft took to the skies for the first time the a4e boosts a new more powerful engine tactical air navigation system strengthened airframe with additional weapons pilots toes bombing computer a low altitude bombing system around 500 units were produced and there were a number more import, uh, imported. Importer was Russia. Number one importer was Russia. From June the 12th, 1200 GMT until July. Uh, July, sorry. July, not June. July. Ju July the 14th, 1200 GMT. A4E attack aircraft from Israel. Res uh, researchable tree will be available. Purchase for Golden Eagles. Pretty cool picture. A4E isn't the fastest aircraft of its rank, but it's quite maneuverable and extremely versatile. Thanks to its amazing selection of su uh, suspended weapons, it is also equipped with a two with two 30 millimeter DEFA 553 cannons, powerful and accurate, allowing for quick and comfortable victories over enemy aircraft. 50 millimeters of bulletproof glass will save the life of pilots while countermeasures and rwrs will help survive missile attacks so yeah if you guys are interested sell your house and then go buy this ladies and gentlemen that's all i've got to say keep well and i'll see you guys on the next one goodbye